Hey guys, thanks for stopping by Smoke with Steve's today. I don't know whether you caught that last video I made or not, but we made a melt in your mouth Texas Roadhouse steak. It was just delicious. Be sure to check that out if you like steak, guys. It was really good. But today, we're going to get that Ninja Creamy Deluxe fired up, and we're going to be making a protein chocolate peanut butter ice cream. We're going to check it out and we're going to add something at the end, mix it in. It's going to make it delicious. So let's go ahead and show you what we're going to do. Okay guys, here's our ingredients for the day. We're going to be using a little silk almond milk, some whole earth sweetener, some Jiffy creamy peanut butter, Hershey's cocoa, and a protein. You can use uh, whatever uh, protein mix you like. But this is what we have on hand, so we're going to be using that today. So let's go ahead and get this measured out and uh, get it all mixed up. Okay, guys, uh, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be uh, putting our ingredients in this bowl here because we're going to be using the uh, immersion uh, blender and blending this up. So let's start out with the uh, Hershey's cocoa here. We're going to add uh, one tablespoon of the cocoa. And I got the uh, Jiffy creamy peanut butter. We're going with the two tablespoons of that. Well, that's about one. So we'll get that in the pool there. Go ahead and grab another one. Okay, then we're going to add our uh, protein to it. Okay guys, we got one scoop of the uh, protein mix. We're going to go ahead and dump that in. And uh, we're going to hold off on that sweetener. We're going to go ahead and get our milk added and uh, get this all mixed up and then we're going to taste it to see if we add, need to add any sweetener. So we're going to take this milk and on this, uh, this right here, well, let's get over here to the English. Uh, we've got scoopables and here's the max fill line. So that's going to be... Uh, where we want to go to. So I'm going to go ahead and pour the milk in this so I get the right amount and then I'm going to transfer that milk into here and then we're going to get her all mixed up. Okay, I put in the, just short of the line there because uh, when we mix it up, it's liable to bring it up to the line. And if we need to add more milk, we'll just add more milk. So let's go ahead and get her dumped in here. Now we're going to get that immersion blender and start mixing. Okay, guys, here's our immersion blender, and uh, we're going to Put him in here a little bit. Gen Try to gently run it. Mix it up. This mix is pretty good. That all blended up good. And once we get that all blended, once we get that all blended, we're going to do it. Taste it here a little bit uh, and see if we need to add any sweetener. So I'm going to give me a little spoon, give me a little taste. Here uh, we determined we didn't need to add any sugar. Uh, it's probably going to be sweet enough, but we think we need a little more peanut butter flavor. So we went ahead and uh, put another tablespoon of uh, peanut butter in here. So uh, we're going to mix this up again.
So we're going to go ahead and get this transferred into the container now. We've got that other tablespoon of peanut butter all mixed in. Tasted it, and it's really tasting good. And the uh, level is just about right. Well, perfect, actually. It's right on the line. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get the cover on, get it in the freezer, and wait 24 hours. And then we'll be mixing it up and making some ice cream. And we're going to mix something else in at the end here. And it's going to even be better. So uh, stay tuned. We're going in to the end of the freezer. This is the hard part, the 24-hour wait. So let's get it in the freezer. Okay, here comes the fun part. That uh, chocolate peanut butter ice cream has been in the freezer for, well, over 24 hours. And we're going to get put, get that pulled out. Get it in that uh, Ninja Creamy. We're going to make some ice cream. And then we're going to add a little bit of crunch to it and mix that in. But uh, before we do that, I want to show you this. Uh, we got a bunch of these little containers that we bought. And uh, we store our ice cream in the these to free up those containers so we can continue to make more ice cream. And also we bought some uh, uh, reusable labels. Uh, these are erasable la labels. That you can use a pen or a felt marker or whatever and just erase them and keep reusing these labels. So uh, it's a win-win. So I'll have a, a link in the description underneath the video where you can check some of the, my favorite stuff out. And I'll price it out, pick, pick you up some if you want. If not, that's fine. But let's pull, get that ice cream pulled out and get to mixing. Okay, we got our Ninja 11-in-1 uh, Creamy pulled out. And we got our ice cream sitting right here. And as you can see, it's all humped up here in the middle. And that needs to be all flattened out. So I'm going to take a spoon to that and uh, get that all leveled out so we can put it in the Ninja. Okay, I got that all leveled out and got that container down in the outer container. So let's get this lid put on. Get our slid in the Ninja, rotate him over, power on, select full, it's going to take two minutes, and we're already on setting on ice cream, so we're going to hit this go button here. And then at the end of two minutes, uh, we'll take a look at it and uh, put our mix in there. Okay, it's just about ready to shut off. And uh, we're going to pull it out of there and take a look at it. So, normally you have to do a remix or a respin on this uh, to get it nice and creamy. So we, we'll uh, wait and see what it looks like. And get our mix in there and do a mix in. Okay, here's what we're using for our crunch today. Right here. Uh, we picked these up at a bakery outlet store, so uh, it's uh, Freshly's Buddy Bars. They're peanut butter wafers, so that's what we're using for our crunch today, and it really ought to be good. Okay, I pulled a bag of these uh, peanut butter bars out, and here's what they look like. Look like. Uh, there's two of them in here. And uh, we're going to be using two of them in the uh, mix. And uh, what I did, just leave them in the bag, just took my hand, crushed them up like that. And uh, it's broken up into real fine pieces, so that's what we're going to be adding into the mix. So let's go ahead and get that done. Okay, as you can see, it's really looking crumbly. But uh, we need to go ahead and get our uh, mix put in the center there. And to do that, we need to take a spoon and just groove us out a hole. I want to try to get that hole all the way down to the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and scoop a little bit of that out of there. Then we're going to take our mix, dump her down in there. Then 
we're going to try to get that some of that the ice cream back in there. Hate to waste this good stuff. Okay, I think that's going to do it. Okay, just a matter of getting that lid on and doing the mix in. Okay, we hit full and then mix in. So uh, it's going to take all that crumbled up uh, wafer, peanut butter wafer, and uh, mix all that in. Okay, we just pulled it out of the uh, mix in cycle and uh, that crumbly's all mixed in there. Now we're going to do the respin. Hit the full and the respin. So, in two minutes for the respin. Here's what she looks like after the uh, respin. Still a little bit crumbly, so we're going to do a second respin. Okay, after the second respin. It's looking pretty creamy. So I'm going to get a couple scoops, put it in a bowl, and be doing a taste test. Looking mighty good. Okay, look at this. Looking mighty good. Give me a little bite right here. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. We're going in. Mmm. Nice and cold. That peanut butter flavor. I'm getting a little bit of that crunch. This is good. Mmm. Wow. This is good stuff. It's not going to last long around here. Guys, give it a try. We're going to have a lot more recipes coming your way. We're going to be having a ball on this channel. This is a lot of fun. This Ninja Creamy coming up with different flavors, different mixes, and it's all good. So guys, be sure to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, share, and like this video. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope to see you on the next one.